The three things where uh, I see India uh, taking the lead, shared mobility, electric mobility, and smart city. I'm Guillaume Gerondeau. I'm a car guy. I spent more than 30 years in the auto industry. Realizing that the future is digital, I joined Dassault System three and a half years ago, and I'm in charge of transportation mobility industry here in Asia. So far, mobility was uh, relatively simple. Huh? You had uh, basically people buying cars or uh, people moving with uh, I would say individual means of mobility and people using public transportation, but more importantly, you had the majority of the population of the world having no or very little access to, to individual mobility. We are moving thanks to uh, digitalization, connectivity, coming soon, autonomy, and also electrification. Uh, we are opening new boundaries for, uh, for mobility, which means that uh, mobility will become more tailor-made, more uh, individual, more based on experience, and uh, cheaper, more sustainable. Autonomy for a vehicle that would be in a certain environment, what we call geofenced environment, uh, completely autonomous, is now coming. I mean, let's be clear, it's going to be next year. The more car you have, the more car we communicate with each other and the more are going to teach each other a different thing, which means that it's becoming exponential. So we can expect that between, let's say, 2020 and 2025, all those experiences that we, that we can see on all continents uh, happening are going to accelerate and that probably in 2025 it's going to become widespread in, uh, in the world. I think we should not think about in the case of India, about uh, uh, autonomy as a way of uh, replacing people with, uh, or, you know, with autonomous uh, vehicle. I think that's not the challenge for India, definitely. The challenge is increase safety and increase uh, productivity of, uh, of uh, transportation and mobility. I think uh, India is a big advantage. When you think to electric mobility, uh, it has to do with the, 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 the battery scarcity. Uh, if you think about providing individual owned ownership mobility to the entire world, the entire seven, eight billion people, means that probably uh, you need to produce 40 million electric cars per year. And that means that you need to, to produce uh, uh, several thousands of gigawatt hour of battery compared to 200 today. The Asus system has all the, all the, the tools. We have a 3D experience city uh, where you can simulate, visualize, and create all the conditions of, uh, of this mobility in the city, which is going to be clean, safe, and, uh, and uh, efficient. I, I don't think, at least in the short term, that it's going to be uh, the big mass transportation for the crowds, for people commuting in, in big cities. It's going to be one of the different arrows that will be at, uh, at the disposal of, uh, of cities to solve or to, uh, to implement this, uh, this smart mobility.